Susan, can you tell me what this is? You're probably right, Cody, but let's give her a chance anyway. And now here comes the explosion. And crispy Woody. Okay, look, I believe you. But why does this keep happening? At first I thought it was fate giving me a chance with Bailey. But even when I swept Bailey off her feet, we were thrown back in time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You swept Bailey off her feet? Well, we were this close to kissing, but she doesn't remember any of it. And she never will. We're trapped in a temporal loop caused by a lightning-induced disruption on the space-time continuum. Huh? Like the kitty menu at Benny's. Horsey can't get out. Whoa! Why didn't you just say so? Listen, Haggis, I know this is going to sound like I've never time madness, but I need your key to the bridge. The ship keeps getting struck by lightning the moment we cross the international date line. But if I reduce our speed, we won't be there when the lightning hits, and we won't have to live the same day over and over again. Ah, the same thing happened to me when I was a mere guppy. Here you go. Cogspeed. Why are you sitting so close to me? Oh, I was just, uh... I didn't say I didn't like it. Attention, everyone. We will be crossing the international date line in three, two, one. Well, that's it. Not much to it, really. Uh, carry on. Thanks, Haggis. Aye. 